there's a world hidden in plain sight. A world of empires built not on land or armies, but on ideas. These empires are ruled by those who dare to think differently, to imagine beyond the conventional. They are the architects of innovation, the sculptors of change. Their currency is not gold or silver, but creativity. We live in a world obsessed with tangible wealth. We see the sprawling mansions, the gleaming sports cars, the headlines splashed with billion dollar valuations. But true wealth is often invisible. It's the spark of an idea, the relentless pursuit of a vision, the audacity to challenge the status quo. This is the wealth that builds empires of the mind. This is a journey into those empires. We'll explore the stories of those who dared to dream differently, who transformed their imagination into tangible reality. We'll uncover the principles that underpin their success, the power of creative thinking, and its undeniable link to wealth creation. This is the story of the unseen empires, the empires of the mind. Thomas Edison, a name synonymous with invention, but his story is not just about light bulbs or phonographs, it's a testament to relentless experimentation. Edison believed in the power of iteration. He famously said, I have not failed. I've just found 10,000 ways that won't work. This relentless experimentation wasn't just a scientific method, it was a mindset. Edison was not afraid to fail, to try and try again. He understood that each failure brought him closer to success. This approach wasn't just about invention, it was about wealth creation. Edison didn't just invent things, he built industries, he created companies, he transformed the world with his ideas. Fast forward to the digital age. Steve Jobs, the maestro of the Mac, revolutionized personal computing. He didn't just build machines, he built experiences. Jobs obsessed over design, he understood the power of aesthetics, he knew that technology had to be beautiful, intuitive, and desirable. This wasn't just about computers. It was about a philosophy. Jobs believed in the power of simplicity. He understood that technology should be accessible to everyone. He wanted to empower people with tools that were both powerful and easy to use. This philosophy translated into phenomenal success. Apple became a global icon. Jobs' vision of elegant design and user-friendly technology resonated with millions. He proved that thinking differently, focusing on the human experience, could build an empire. Enter Warren Buffett, the Oracle of Omaha. Buffett's empire is built on financial acumen. His genius lies in seeing value where others don't. He's a master of understanding businesses, of identifying long-term potential. This isn't just about money, it's about understanding value. Buffett's approach is grounded in patience and discipline. He's not swayed by fleeting trends. He focuses on the fundamentals, on the underlying strength of a business. This long-term vision has made Buffett one of the wealthiest individuals on the planet. He's proven that intellectual capital, the ability to analyze and understand, is a powerful form of wealth creation. The internet age ushered in a new breed of innovators. Jeff Bezos, the architect of Amazon, saw the potential of e-commerce before most. He built a company that revolutionized online shopping, forever changing the retail landscape. Bezos' vision wasn't just about selling things online, it was about customer obsession. He understood that the key to success was to offer unparalleled convenience and value to the customer. This customer-centric approach fueled Amazon's meteoric rise. The Bezos Blueprint is a testament to the power of foresight, of understanding the direction of the future. He saw the potential of the internet to transform commerce, and he capitalized on it, building an empire that continues to expand. Elon Musk, the modern-day Renaissance man, embodies the spirit of audacious innovation. From electric cars with Tesla to space exploration with SpaceX, Musk sets his sights on ambitious goals that challenge conventional thinking. Musk's approach is characterized by a relentless pursuit of the extraordinary. He's not content with incremental improvements. He wants to revolutionize industries to solve fundamental challenges facing humanity. This ambition has driven him to achieve breakthroughs once deemed impossible. 
The Muskian revolution is a testament to the power of vision, of setting audacious goals and relentlessly pursuing them. Musk's story inspires us to dream bigger, to think beyond the limitations of the present. These stories highlight a common thread. Each of these individuals broke the mold. They didn't follow the well-trodden path. They charted their own course, driven by their unique vision and unwavering belief in their ideas. This is the essence of creativity. It's about challenging assumptions, questioning the norm and daring to imagine a different reality. It's about seeing possibilities where others see obstacles. It's about turning those possibilities into tangible results. This is the key to unlocking the empires of the mind. It's not about conforming to existing paradigms. It's about pushing boundaries, exploring uncharted territories and creating something truly new. In a world of rapid change and relentless disruption, the ability to think creatively is no longer a luxury. It's a necessity. The old rules no longer apply. The traditional models are being upended. Success in this new world requires a different mindset, a mindset that embraces innovation. This isn't just about individual success, it's about the future of our societies. The challenges we face, from climate change to economic inequality, demand creative solutions. We need innovators, thinkers and dreamers who can envision a better future and build the path to get there. The empires of the mind are not just about personal wealth, they are about collective progress. They are about building a better world. A world where innovation drives positive change and creates opportunities for all. The true legacy of these empires of the mind is not just the wealth they generate, it's the impact they have on the world. These innovators have transformed industries, created jobs and improved the lives of countless people. Their stories remind us that true wealth goes beyond monetary value. It's about the positive change we bring to the world. It's about the legacy we leave behind. It's about making a difference that resonates far beyond our own lifetimes. This is the greater wealth. The wealth that comes from creating, from innovating, from leaving the world a better place than we found it. It's a wealth that enriches not just individuals, but entire societies. As we move deeper into the 21st century, the concept of wealth is being redefined. The digital age has given rise to new forms of value, new ways to create and share wealth. Innovation itself is becoming a currency, a measure of worth in a rapidly evolving world. This raises a new set of questions. How do we measure the value of innovation? How do we foster an environment that encourages creative thinking? How do we ensure that the benefits of innovation are shared equitably? The next frontier of this exploration into the empires of the mind will delve into these questions, exploring the concept of innovation as currency. We'll examine how innovation is transforming the very fabric of wealth creation, shaping the future of industries, and redefining our understanding of value in the modern world.